More affordable housing is coming to Albuquerque. City councilors gave the green light last night to two new apartment complexes right on Central Avenue. Monica Lagronio joins us with more on these plans. So Monica, this is coming at a time where the demand for housing, of course, especially affordable housing, just keeps growing in our city. That's exactly right, Julie. Adding more housing to Albuquerque is one of the goals Mayor Tim Keller has set for his administration. And now 166 new apartments are coming our way. I think this is a great way um, to invest in those infill areas and really reinvest in those MR areas. Monday night, City Council approved two new housing projects. Somos and 66 will replace vacant lots along Central Avenue. These renderings show what the buildings will look like. Councillor Renee Grout shared her excitement during Tuesday's council meeting. I travel along Central um, going home and or that's my area where my business is and both of these projects I am looking forward to so much. So I'm excited. The 66 will be a three-story multifamily building with 96 units. That complex will be on Adams and Central. Somos will be slightly smaller with 70 units of affordable housing on Central and Alcazar. The Housing Forward program requires hundreds of new units of housing and so this is a way to put about 150 on the market in the short term and it's the kind of redevelopment we like along our sort of core uh, along Route 66 and so this is a very good thing for housing in our city. Last year Mayor Tim Keller introduced the Housing Forward initiative. His administration wants to add 5,000 new housing units to the city. These new buildings will help make a bit of a dent in that goal. This helps us move towards that goal of 5,000 units. Uh, we're hoping a lot of those come from casitas, uh, but we also know the city said that we would step up to try and redevelop some properties along Central. And so I think in aggregate, we're probably around 500 units now that we've created. And so we're on our way, but it's going to take a few more years. Mayor Keller said these buildings will be available in the short term, which means that can be anywhere from one to three years. In terms of the next steps, the buildings will be bid on and then we'll start construction. Back to you guys. All right, Monica, thanks for the update there.